and that's what that Ohio State defense does to you, right? Just just making you take care of the basketball and have less time on the other end. Oh, Cody McMahon just bullied Shelly to the rim. Get themselves back on track after they were held to 45 points, two for 25 for three against Rutgers. Yeah, this is not a good offensive performance by any standard against Rutgers. That's two strong, powerful young women. McMahon was intent on blocking the shot. Markowski intent on not blocking it. How about McMahon just coming back and answering? Okay, I don't block your shot. Christo finds Mikulashikova, and she's got the three. Mikulashikova and really has that speed advantage to be able to take her to the rim. Mike Sell, so quick, drains it. Has to work again and gets it to drop. A nice move. Just with the dribble and the mid-range jumper showing her array of moves. Jazz Shelley, everything tough, trying to get inside against Ohio State. So Sam Hybe knocks down the three. She's had more success in getting to the free throw line than typically dialing it up from three. Bristow gets it to drop as well at Ohio State. Everywhere on the court, using her, her quickness to move her around, and that's something she's developed during the course of her career. Maggie Mendelson passed up a shot right at the rim. Five seconds on the clock for Hake. Markowski just has to throw it up. <laughs> through a double clutch jump shot by Markowski in the mid-range tight roped along the baseline to be able to keep that ball alive Sam Hybe snaps her way in and one five seconds for Mike up Harris wide open right in front of her team's bench and that's exactly what Ohio State needed yeah, McMahon had that, that where she twisted her ankle in the first half, had to go out to get the, the retake. She picks up her fouls. Another bank, this time from long range for Mikulashikova. One minute to play in the third. Big response by the Huskers at home, slicing in Ricky Harris. What body control from Harris. The first on Markowski. 10 seconds on the clock, Fury, and one. Mike Sell has that blocked by Shelly, staying right with the guard, but another chance for the Buckeyes. Mika Lashikova, 25 points. Outside mid-range free throw line. It's been a remarkable afternoon. And it's been balanced 12 of those 25 points in the second half as Bourne scores off the feed right at the rim. Nebraska made it a one possession game. It was once 48 to 45. Heaven Bristow having a game off the bench and feeds. Nebraska hasn't succumbed to that. They haven't turned the ball over in this game. But what Nebraska seems to be worn down by inside shooting 67 percent from the field and another great example of body control by the ohio state guard the program record for consecutive wins is 20 last done in the 2005 2006 season so clearly they're flirting with that coach williams said williams says this is a team striving for consistency it's been a lot of up and down this year. It's really interesting because Nebraska's had to deal with injuries. Sam Hybe, born who scores there, were out for a time. Beating Maryland, that was a, a big win for Nebraska at the time. Ricky Harris misses everything. Fury does not yeah. right there at the rim. But how about Fury going from averaging three points per game last year mm -hmm. to now 12? Yeah, well, yeah, another example of a greatly improved player. Kroll gets around Harris. Great body control again. The quickness, the length of Ohio State causes so many problems for their opponents. She's born. Nets, excuse me, Jazz Shelley. But it is Ohio State, the focal point of not just the conference, 
but of the nation. Make it 18-0 for the Buckeyes.